In today's video, I am going to be breaking down a couple of different four out basketball plays that you can run with your team, especially if you've got a shooting guard who can shoot the lights out of the ball. So let's get down and let's check out these basketball plays that can get your shooting guard some easy baskets. Okay, so number one is we need to get player two, he is our shooting guard, some open shots. Whether it's some open layups or some open threes, we need him to be able to hit some shots. One of my most favorite plays is to have player five set a screen on player one, and at the same time, player four to set a back screen on player two. Once this is set, player one is going to dribble off towards his left side and player two is going to have two different options depending on what his defender does. So for example, if player two's defender goes underneath that screen, what we need to see is for player two to get cut out this side and for player one to attack the basket as hard as possible so that it forces the help from player two. The other option is we can just do a lob pass over to player two, who can then hit that three point shot. Now, instead, if there's that, that screen and player two tries to go over top of that screen, player two blue needs to cut towards the basket so that player one is able to hit him with the pass for the layup. This is how you use a screen, generally speaking, off ball and can get you a lot of points. This next play, we're going to have player three cut out towards this far side. Player one is going to then dribble out towards where player three was. We're going to have a screen set by player four and a staggered screen set around the elbow for player or from, from player five. Once these screens are set and player three clears out, player two is going to be then sprinting towards the point. Depending on what his defender is going to do, he may have the option for a three point shot or if his defender went over top of the screens and chased player two over top, as we would basically see right here, if he was be getting chased over top, he needs to cut in. That's going to give him the open lane to the basket for player one to pass him the ball for that layup. This is a very simple play and these are somewhat simple plays to be able to run with middle school or older teams. Now going back to what I like to do with the four out offense is to get the ball into player five as early as possible. But really quickly one of the easiest ways to be able to defend plays like this is with my unbeatable basketball zone defense. So make sure to go check out that link down below if you want to stop plays like these. After we've made that pass into player five, I want to see a screen away by player one and then player two is going to use that screen. If player two's man gets caught on that screen, there's no switch, then player two is going to have an open three at the top. However, if player two's man follows him over the screen, player five is going to take one dribble up. He's going to do the dribble handoff with player two, and then player two is going to attack the rim and go for that layup. Now, the benefit here of what a lot of younger teams will make a mistake on after this dribble handoff player three's defender will help off this is a ridiculously bad defensive decision in this case player three can then glide down towards the corner this can be a kick out pass to player three and player three will get the three point shot and player two our shooting guard will get the assist now even though this may not be a basket for player two it's still an assist and can get another teammate open for a three-point shot. However, the main option is to get player two into that layup or off of that initial screen for that three-point shot. The idea behind these plays is to be able to get as many three-point shots as possible or open layups. If you want to be able to stop plays like these, make sure to go check out my Unbeatable Basketball Zone Defense book that is down in the description below. I'll see you guys again in my next video. I hope that these plays help your team win more games.